Zebra Herd, welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. Today, we're exploring more of the Dark World and trying to get to the third temple all the way up there by where it was, the Lost Woods. And I figure we have a lot to do all along the way there. <laughs> we're gonna be trying to adventure basically the left half of the map, or at least most of it, uh, looking for just extra goodies and stuff. I'm sure there's a ton we can get done near the Kakariko Village area, so we'll try that out. We'll see how it goes, because I explored a lot of the East area in the last two episodes, so just sort of trying to continue that idea a little bit, but um, I'm sure at this point I've missed a good few things. I plan on um, seeing how I'm recording this whole series before it goes live, uh, live, so I might not be able to use feedback too much, unfortunately, but I do want to, oh boy, get rid of this guy. Well, I'm getting a lot of hearts, luckily, but yeah, I want to be able to backtrack at some point or maybe just double check that I've gotten everything. I'm probably going to do that right before we, you know, go to the final boss area, wherever that might end up being, but this looks weird. This looks like something I might want to teleport with. Uh, let's try that out. Uh, boom. And let's see. Oh, look at this. There's a little bomb here for some reason I'm not gonna mess with. But yeah, this is, I guess it's right over here, okay. What's inside of this then? That is a question I need answered. It looks like lots of hearts first off, which I really needed. Oh, can I get three hearts out of this? One. Ah, no. Oh well, well I do get a heart right here. Just a piece of it apparently. Uh, so we're halfway through until our next heart piece, which is amazing. Super excited, looking forward to that. And now, I guess we should uh, hop down this way. Start taking care of these guys. Actually, wait, no, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I'm just now realizing I was supposed to go back into the doubt, dark realm. Hmm. I don't know what to do about that. Uh. It'd be convenient if it gave me, because I can't possibly get back up there. If it gave me little markers on where the Dark World teleporters are, that was silly of me. That was really silly. I guess the best thing I can do is go back to the swamp, because in the swamp there was a teleporter. Whoops, sorry. Okay, so what's going to go on down this way? Is this the correct direction? I think. Looks like it. So these buildings are all still up and maybe there'll be new inhabitants in them. I'm not really sure what's going on with this, uh, but we're gonna try it out. Oh, hey, look at this. Well, howdy, Light Worlder. You look like a straight shooter. Wanna try your skill in shooting my, my shooting gallery? I'll give you five shots for 20 rupees. If you're as sharp as I think you are, you stand to rake in the rupees. How about it, stranger? Play or no way, we're gonna play. All right, aim carefully, go. So I guess I'm supposed to avoid the hands and try to hit the little, oh no, oh no. Uh, uh, this guy's confidence in me was not well placed. Oh, he's happy about that one though. Ah, okay, I only got one shot in there. That's fine, we'll try again. Wanna shoot again? Yes. Maybe if I land all the shots, they'll give me a heart piece or something. So basically I messed it up that time. No! Oh, luckily I have lots of rupees. Oh, so if the more I get, the more I combo up, the better. Okay, we'll just keep trying this until things go better, which that was not, oh darn, come on. Dang it, <laughs> no, I'm missing every single one of them this time. No! Okay, yeah, I wanna shoot again. All right, ready, set, go. Dang it! Ah, oh, man, not good, not good. That's good. And then, eight, all right. There, there's 16, so I'm making my money back for this one. No! Go on, I gotta keep trying, I gotta get all five of them. I mean, if I w technically wait long enough, I can always get it, so like, there's like all the hands that pop up and then there's like a little gap. Oh, darn! If I just wait for that gap, darn it. I guess these little things in the background are supposed to be like octopus or squid or something. Ah, oh, not good, not good. Come on. I have plenty of money to spend. You have no idea. Got it. There's the first one. Oh, now. Yeah, there's the second one. Lots of pressure right now. Ah, oh, darn. It's really tough. Oh, I'm just really bad at the game. One of the two. Dang. <laughs> I will get it eventually. Oh, there it is! Okay, so I got all five of them. That didn't really do anything more for me. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, well, I was hoping that would give me like a heart piece or something, but I got all five in a row. That brought me back up to almost four rupees, so not really nothing lost, nothing gained, right? So not too much going on with that one, but over this way is where we got a heart piece in the light world. There's not even like a house here. Oh, whoa, 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 hold on, I spoke too soon. There is somebody here. What is this about? Hmm. Hello. Welcome to the treasure field. The object is to dig as many holes as you can in 30 seconds. Any treasures you dig up will be yours to keep. It's only 80 rupees to play. What do you say? I want to dig. Then I will lend you a, sh a shovel. When you have it in your hand, start digging. Press the Y button to dig. Okay, so I gotta quickly switch to it, right? Um, I don't have the shovel. Oh, I guess it's everything is automatically Huh, interesting. I feel like there's gonna be somewhere like a heart piece, but where, you know? This definitely feels like it's subject to a heart piece, though. Um, I don't know. I mean, I'll just keep digging. Whoa, can't do that? I guess he can't. Oh, okay, game's over. I didn't actually pick up too many of the rupees. Um, well, actually, I guess I get to now. That's fine, I mean, I'm at 999. Uh, wait, what does it say? Come back again, I'll be waiting for you. Why can't I just, do I have to leave and go? That whole deal, probably. Weird. Well, here we go again. He's waiting for me. One of these has to be a heart piece, right? So I just have to like dig through the whole thing over and over until I find it, which is just gonna be wonderful. Oh, there it is, awesome. That took me so much time. Oh my gosh, like 20 minutes of just digging around. I did look it up just to make extra sure that there was a heart piece here and it's totally random which spot you find it in. So I just finally got lucky enough that I, I have it. So you found a piece of heart, three out of four. How cool is that? That took way too long, <laughs> way too long. I don't understand why they made it that way, but they did. Anyways, now that that's done, there's still plenty more of the town we can explore and I wanna do exactly just that. So first off, we were already in this room. This is the bow and arrow room, but I could go up this way, right? Oh no, I can't, at least not from here. Oh darn. So if I wanna go up, I'm gonna have to do the long way around. That's sort of a pain in the booty. Is this also another darker one that you just can't move? It looks like it. Then what's up here? Oh, it's the same thing, okay. Huh. Well then my best bet, like I said, is to go the long way around, which will totally stink, but I, I guess, I guess I'll do that, but I can't, the bridge is out. How do I get across? Oh, that was something. Where are we? We're right here just like in the forest by our, what's supposed to be our house. Oh, fairies, nice. Okay, I'll take these, absolutely. Let's grab a couple, there we go. Keep it in a bottle, put it in a bottle, and then one more, put it in a bottle, and then I'll keep this one for full health because I only have three bottles. That'll be useful at the least. I, I'm starting to think, I got the hook shot out before because I'm thinking my best bet for getting across, if there's no like entryway from the water, maybe there's somewhere I can hook shot. I mean, I got this hook shot last episode, right? Oh gosh, the trees are so rude around here. Um, That might be like my best bet when it comes to finding things. So I'm gonna try to charge around the entirety of all the rivers and lakes, ow, uh, and see how it goes and hope for the best. This looks odd. Oh, okay, well there we go. We're over here now. So, yep, we're now on this side, which means we can explore all of this now, which will be great. So, let's get to it. I have no clue what we're to find around here, but I'll try my best. I probably shouldn't have done that. But um I mean, hopefully we find easier ways to get around because that was like an oddly specific area. I looked across the whole river. I didn't see anything else similarly like that. And that was like off the screen too. So, I thought like that was like just a bit uncool in general. Okay, come on. Got him. A little bit more. Yeah. Okay, so that's another bomb. Actually, we're at our maximum of 20, so it doesn't matter much either. Way. There we go. Get rid of this guy as much as I can. Just don't want to deal with these guys. They're, they're big, they're mean. I mean. Don't drop anything I exactly need. Oh, I know that this had a pit in it in the other dimension, the other world, but I guess it doesn't here. Hmm, and what about over this way? Oh, I see. 
Oh, wasn't this something? Oh gosh, a B, not another B. I'm a little confused, but I do think this was something. Um, I'm gonna have to be careful here. Yeah, leave me alone, sir. Because I'm pretty sure we're in the gravestone next to the place, next to the hideout. So if I am to do this, as you can see, ah, yeah. Whoa, what's with the ghosts? Ghosts weren't there before. They're there now, though. Yeah, get rid of this guy. So yeah, this whole area was closed off. Correct? Correct. But, oh, you know what? If I smash it, that might be my answer. So let's get like, to this angle. Oh, that made a little ding. So maybe now I can like push it? Yeah, what's with these ghosts? I've never seen these ghosts before. That's not really doing much though. No, there's gotta be something we can do here. Maybe I have to, cause like there's no other way here. That didn't work. Dude, you messed it up. Huh. What's up with that? Well, it's back now. Will that work? No. What's going on here? Why did it work that time? I already tried that once. This game is so picky with me. What's in here then? Maybe another heart piece? There's a treasure chest. Oh, this is the magic cape. You are invisible when you wear it. Watch your magic meter. Huh, so we got another new item. And if I use it, as he says, I'm invisible. Ooh, that's cool, but my magic meter drains. Okay, well, I don't know if I need that too much, but there are still other things to explore around here, but in the dark world first. Yeah, there's a cave up there. And we can get to it through here. Ooh, very fancy. I'm gonna wanna switch to the, the magic mirror. Boom. And here we go. Oh, not much in here. I was hoping for a bit more. <laughs> well, actually, no, there's a bombable spot over there. We can do that, I think. Yeah, that looks like it. Boop. Oh. Got it. Hey, look at that heart piece. And that is a full heart container gained. That's amazing. So that's like this area explored, it seems. We might be able to poke around with some more. I'll look around, but yeah, let's go back into the dark world. So whenever there's sort of something peculiar out of place like that, I just gotta make sure. Gotta poke around a little bit. I don't think there was anything more like that in this area. Oh, what about this cave? Well, this is where the this the sanctuary used to be. Oh, hello. Hey, I'll tell you a profitable story if you pay me 20 rupees, sure. Ha, thank you. To tell you the truth, I found an incredible beauty inside the pyramid, but someone sealed the door. You can't do anything with a standard bomb, they say. Oh, I saw that. So a standard bomb is not good enough. We need a super bomb. I'll keep it in mind. Can I pick this up? You bet I can. Huh. Why do these look like an arrow pointing to the right? Hmm. I mean, maybe there's something to the right. Down here? This looks pretty normal to me. Hmm. So where are we right now? We're right below the entrance normally to what would be the Death Mountain, which I think is still Death Mountain here. It's just dark Death Mountain, which just makes it even worse. Uh, this way, cave. Ah, yes, cave. My favorite place. I guess I'll check that out in a moment. Cause I'll have to go over that area at some point, right? If I want to get here to number seven. So we'll have to try that sooner or later. But right for right now, whoa, whoa, what was that? How do you do that? He was just like, jab, 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 jab. <laughs> That's cool. I haven't seen him do that before. Hmm, I don't think there's any reason to hop into the water here. Ooh, this is the entrance to the Lost Woods, which also means we're about to enter the Kakariko Village area, which I've been meaning to explore. Got him. And let's get this dude a little bit. Come on. So what does it say now? This way, Skeleton Forest. This way, Village of Outcasts. Yikes. 
And you're still a fortune teller? You are. Hmm, you look like you might have an interesting destiny. May I tell your fortune? Sure. You don't look any different either. <laughs> okay. Abracadabra Alakazam! You will find a mushroom lover at the magic shop. Now, I will take 15 rupees. I hope you will be healthy. <laughs> so I have to find... Huh. Okay, so I have to go... I've already given her a mushroom. Interesting. Oh, hey, fairies. Thank you. Good to know that's in there. Well, let's go into the village of outcasts. I mean, I don't want to spend too much time in here. It looks like there is a way to get into here, but I don't want to do that now. And I'll just avoid it if I have to. Hmm. And I might want to use the mirror too, just to sort of have like a compare and contrast kind of thing. There we go. Because I've done most of what there is to do in this village, I, as far as I understand. I mean, I did get the flute, and he did say, oh, actually, I want to try that. Let's do the Light World one. Because remember, we got the flute or the ocarina or whatever. And there's, the guy said that like his father, can you go talk to his father? Which I think is the sad guy down this way. So we're gonna find out and see if maybe we can make him happy or maybe we could play him music for him, some tunes. Uh, so now he's just sleeping. He's not even talking about his son anymore. What if instead I pause the game and I play the song? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is my son's flute. Did you meet my son? Where is he? Is he all right? Oh, I see. Well, I can tell what, what you want to say by the look on in your eyes. Oh, was that all I could do? Would you keep the flute? And will you play that sweet melody for the bird in the village square? Oh, cool. I beg of you, please. My son would probably want it this way. But still, I wish I could see him once more. All right. Hello. Wow, I saw her, a very nice young lady at the waterfall of the wishing. Yeah, we already heard about this. Anyways, let's go and do that then. At the town square, play the flute. Well, the town square, ah, should be this, right? Ooh. This is cool. I like this, this is cool. Uh, but, well that, there's a bird, whoa! The bird was within the sign. That doesn't make any sense. Hello there, you're like a little duck. Uh, goodbye. Okay. Did that do anything? What if I played again? Oh, hey! Oh, look at this! Whoa, it's a fast travel! Oh, that's so cool! So I could go here, if I wanted to. Nobody's stopping me. And I can play it again. Okay, I was gonna say, if he doesn't come and get me, I'm gonna be really upset. <laughs> that's awesome, that's gonna make the game so much easier. Oh, I'm so happy! Okay, so is there anything else I could really do around here? I don't think so, so you know what? Let's go teleport back to the dark world. I don't know if the birdie will help me there. But, that's all right. Well, if I keep finding all these different, you know, dark ward warps, we'll eventually be able to get back to where we were. Okay. This ghost is not very nice. Trying to get rid of him and his friend. So a lot of these buildings are like underground. I can't go into them. They're like sunken in, which is really weird. Um, hmm. Let's get this guy a little bit. Got him. This is the village of outcasts. People without rupees are not welcome here. All right. Well, luckily I have rupees. Almost the maximum amount you could possibly hold, apparently. Is there anything really too much I can do, though? I mean, so far it's looking like a bit of a lackluster. What in the world is going on here? This wiggly water. Huh, that's weird. Let's go into this one. Oh, it's a, it's a chest room? Oh, hello. Hi, may I help you? You can open two chests for 30 rupees. Why don't you play? Okay, sure. Well, good luck. Um, is this gonna be another one where it's just like, I gotta get really lucky to find a heart? Probably. Can't open any more chests, the game is over. Okay. Gonna have to keep trying this, aren't I? We'll try a couple of times on camera. Uh, I'm feeling good about this one and this one. I'm getting my money back at the least. That's good. <laughs> so I gotta keep trying this until we get the ones we want. Okay, I will play. 
Whoa, 100 rupees. I'm making my money back like crazy, which is silly because I don't even need it. I just keep hitting the maximum over and over again, which is really silly. There it is, all right, you found a piece of heart. Very cool, that was lucky. And I still have one more to open. There's my rupees back. All right, well that actually wasn't so bad. Glad I was able to get that done. So two pieces of heart just from little mini games, what in the world? Who is this supposed to be? Like the, the head outcast? Whoa, ah, no, my stuff! Hey, get, get out of here, be gone. <laughs> okay, well, whatever. Ah, and evil skeletons attacking me. I don't need to deal with this. I have two heart pieces. <laughs> oh, there's a chest in here. 300 rupees, I didn't need a single one of those, I was already at maximum. Yikes. And we got Mario's nose over this way. Will this one give me any money? I guess not. Huh, okay. I just wanna make sure I explore every room though. Every four, whoa, the poor Kuko is just like a little skeleton bird. Oh, I have the ability to do this. Up, right there, and Okay, it's just another shop in such a dangerous world, blah, 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 blah. Actually, all my shields, not my shields, my, my bottles are filled up. So that's not too helpful for me. Okay. I don't currently uh, have full health, so I don't have my super swing. There we go. So hopefully somebody drops a heart soon. What is going on here? This is the village of the outcast, blah, 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 blah. So we've already read all that. Not too much going on with this building. Most of them are destroyed. Ooh, that's probably something I can bomb into. Let's find out. Oh, sorry. They make the same noises as the Kukos. Ooh, another chest. Another 300 rupees I do not need. Yikes. All right, well, if I needed rupees, I know where I could have gone. Except for the fact that I messed it up. Hmm. Oh, there's another fairy. So now I'm back at full health. This guy really doesn't like me. Hmm, so I don't know if there is too much more. Except for one thing I do know of. Oh, leave me alone. <laughs> Stop chasing me. Um, There should be the guy to the right. Yeah, way over, wait, do we go into here? I think we did. Yep. But over... What's with this? This is weird, isn't it? There are just more fairies. Lots of fairies hidden around here. Yeah, over this way then. There's like the old dude's house. But it's a little weird. I can't actually go over there? Maybe there's a warp somewhere though. Yeah, let's teleport back like this. Yeah, that's weird, isn't it? Um. Hmm. Oh, but I can get up there and squish that with the hammer now. Oh, sorry, Kuko, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, look at this. Okay, so, boop. Is there anything else of interest around here, by the way? Not really. But I didn't even need the dark world for this one. That's fine, whee! I mean, I'm sure, hopefully, eventually, we can get into this building. Oh, so we can go up or down. I'm going to go up. Whoa, what is this? Oh, is this like a free health refill? I think it might be. I'm gonna let you free. No. What is this? So I don't know what the deal with this is, so I'm just gonna leave it for now. And I thought that was gonna be a heart piece, I was all excited. It's some weird red pot I can't do anything with. I figured it was just like health potion so I could just fill it up and get something for free. I guess not. But at least we know maybe we could come back here with some other item. I don't know. Uh, back to the dark world. Don't know too much more of what there is to do except for just going to the Lost Woods. So I think that that's what we'll start to do now. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. I mean, it did, you know, before we go though. Also, I have, I wonder if there'll still be fairies in here. Because if so, that'd be perfect. Ah, not anymore, darn, that sinks. Oh, well, that's fine. I have enough as it is, but, the fortune teller did tell me that I should go get the potion, the potion powder. What's weird is that I went to her before 
and she said that she needed a couple more days. So I don't know how long she needs, but I guess it should just be ready now. And that's gonna be way over on this side, right? I mean, I think. Okay. Ah, uh, well maybe I shouldn't have done that because now I'm gonna have to hook shot across again. Maybe I should've made a, uh, I probably should've just quick traveled. So I think I would, would've had the ability to. I don't know. Um, for right now though. Oh gosh, come on over here. Fight this guy away. Well, actually, I have to go back to the to the light. Ow, world, you are so mean. So mean. All right, I'm sick of that stuff. Go like this. Get out of here. And talk to you again. Hello. Hmm, the smell of rotten fruit. If you give me that mushroom, I can finish my brew. I already gave you a rotten mushroom, though. Do you have anything to say? What is this? Is this it? This is magic power, charged sprinkled on enemies and many other things. Red is the medicine of life, green is the medicine of magic. Oh yeah, okay, I know about that. Huh, how much you wanna bet <laughs> this is what I was supposed to sprinkle on that thing? Probably. I'm very silly, so I guess I'll go do that now. Uh, You know what, I'm getting the flute then. Pull the flute back out. And there we go. Yeah, this is right on top of a teleport spot. I could have, you know, been totally fine with that. I don't know how I'm gonna get easily back to the dark world at this point, but I'll find a way. Hopefully. Uh, but for right now, I actually don't need it. I just need to go back this way. I'm gonna try that because it said sprinkled on many other things. That seems like a thing I can sprinkle it on. Oh, I wonder if there's there'll be more here now. There should be. Uh, boop. Not really. <laughs> Hmm, I'll go over here. Excuse me, Mr. Chicken. Do yeah, we know the way through now? I don't think there's anything else around here too much. So back up this way. Pause the game, pull out the powder. Where's the powder at? It's up here in this corner. Bah, whoa, it's a bat. Hey, blast you for making, waking me from my my deep, dark sleep. I mean, thanks a lot, sir. But now I will get my revenge on you. Get ready for it, uh, if that's okay with you. Sir? Ah! Um. Oh no. <laughs> I laugh at your misfortune. Now your magic power will drop by one half. Oh no! Congratulations, now do your best, even though I'm sure it won't be enough. Have a nice day, see you. What, so is it half as powerful? Or is it using one half of the magic power? I think it might be the latter. <laughs> Maybe it wasn't as bad as he seems. Weird. Anyways, there is that done. For real now, we're gonna go to the Lost Woods. I don't know if there's too much I can do while it's Light World, but maybe, I feel like there should be more teleports to the Dark World around here. Cause I feel like they're just too far and few between. So maybe we should just poke around the Lost Woods a little bit. I feel like we should have explored it more while we had the chance before, but now that I have like the little hammer, I think there were a couple spaces like that around. I might be wrong. That is a bomb in it this time. Am I going the wrong way? I'm going the wrong way. Can you stop, sir? Don't you think I have better things to do than to be attacked by you? I'm a busy, busy zebra. I don't see oh, too much going on here except for more explosives and bushes. At least the Dark World doesn't have that so far. That's one thing going for it. Hmm. Oh, okay, so I, oh, but I could go over there by the other angle. So maybe I can loop around? Hmm, let's hope so. Oh, there's another heart. I just need a half a heart. I can go back to my super moves. Let's see if, Either of these guys are willing. Ow, to drop one. Not quite. Oh, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> all right, all is right in the world again. So back into the dark woods, and then we'll move just slightly to the right and see if we can't leave from there. I love the way this looks now that it's not all foggy. Like, it looked really cool before, but I do really miss the dark woods music. Anyways, we'll do this. Whoa, whoa, full refill from that, cool. And is there any, there has to be something. Aha, okay, exactly what I needed. And look at that. 
we're in the dark world. Hey, hey, no, no silliness. I don't appreciate that. So we have to like re-explore re all of the, oh gosh. <laughs> that got his little friend over there, actually. That was perfect. Um, but we need to re-explore all of this forest. Oh, the music here is intimidating. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about this one. Whoa, instead of like logs, it's like giant rib cages. Slain beasts. Okay, this is a bit of a dead end. Whoa, except for the angry skeleton. Get out of here. Can I pick this one up? You bet I can. But that was not quite the way to go. I'd rather go the wrong way first so I don't have to go back down that way. I'm gonna explore some other stuff. Hmm. Because I know there's a way to get up. I just don't quite know how to get there for right now. Oh, I can go between these trees. Oh, there's like a pit over there. I mean, that has to be something of interest. Where exactly am I? I'm trying to go way over there. Hmm. All right. Whoop. Bah. All right, well, I'm doing everything I can. There we go. See you, dude. And what about all this stuff, though? Not too much, there's a heart there I don't need. But can I go between these trees? Oh, I was hoping I could. Because I don't know how to get to that. I guess we'll just have to figure it out because no clear way about it. I mean, this is an exit, right? Yeah, now we're back out here, which is not quite what I needed. Weird, very weird. Uh, okay, excuse me, pardon me. I gotta take care of this guy. There it is. Hmm. I don't see too much going on this way. But this is where I came from. So unless there's like some kind of weird, crazy loop around I can do that I'm not seeing. I really don't see that anyway. <laughs> what do you know? There has to be some kind of secret waiting for us somewhere. But this is where I came from. So this whole path must be wrong. Either that or I seriously missed something. But then this brings me back here. Is there really even any other way to enter it? I mean, there may be and I'm just missing it. Yeah, let's try from this way. This might be just luckier. Hmm. I, mean, I don't think so, because I didn't see any other ways upwards, but it might just be very confusing. Oh man, he almost, he almost got me there, whoa. I mean, maybe these pits aren't for me to fall into, or maybe they are. Whoa. So is this, is this whole forest the dungeon? Is that the idea? Oh man, if it is, that's crazy. Oh, that's cool. You can like knock away the bramble. Hey now, watch it. Stay away, stay far away. Hmm. Lots of wild stuff going on. No, I'm very bad at this game. Huh. Oh, watch it. Throw it. Or not. There we go. Okay. What's in this room? So I guess we're just in the dungeon now. Like, that has to be what's going on. We're in a dungeon. Isn't that weird? <laughs> That's not really the most formal introduction to a dungeon I would have expected. Is this guy just like not defeatable? He's taking, okay, a lot of damage. He was like a red one. I didn't know if that meant that like he could not be squandered. Oh, we get a chest for all that. Whoa, you found the compass. Now you can pinpoint the lair of the dungeon's evil master. Okay, that's great and everything, but it also pinpoints my doom with all these extra pits. What did I do to activate that? Just touch the chest? Man, there's more than one way to go too. Okay. Mummies, no, I don't like mummies. They're spooky. Come on, get them. Almost, right? There we go. A key, not bad. Cause there's a door right here that requires one. Got rid of him. Uh, that wasn't too bad. The problem is they run right for you right away, so you can't exactly, whoa! Hey, no! What, what is that about? You just, you just throw a giant hand at me from nowhere. 
That's not how things work. No! What? I was busy fighting. I'm back here. Why did that make a noise as if I solved something? I'm pretty sure that was the opposite of solving something. So I'm back here now because, ah! It sent me back here. Because as if the game wasn't difficult enough without giant hands from the sky that just steal you from your position. All right, well, excuse me. I got places to be. Okay, so I definitely need to knock them off before they knock me off. Maybe I'll just go this way for now. Just quickly try to figure out what in the world's going on over here. Looks like just as much dangerous stuff. Oh, and the hand is back. So I need to be constantly just jumping and dodging and moving, because I do not want to be grabbed again. Get out of here. Oh, I can fight it though. Ooh, get out of here, Mr. Hand. You weren't being very handy. His mommy can walk out your back, or you had a friend. Oh man. I'm waiting for it. Get out of here. Thank you. I feel like everything is now a trap to distract me from the hand attacking. Just like that. And we get another key. That's cool and everything. But it's also not cool how many people are chasing me right now. One of these bramble spots. Ah, <laughs> has to be an entryway somehow. I mean, can I just, yeah, look at that. Oh, that was cool. And we get the map. I don't know if that's how I was supposed to do that. I mean, I guess I could have just done that. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. I'm just trying to go this way. I don't know why that's so complicated. Whoa. Uh, so how am I getting into this? Hmm. I mean, I have another key, but this looks like it leads outside. You see all the lights emanating from it? It does, whoa, spooky. Yeah, this one has like a proper open mouth. I don't think I was over here before. So I don't really know where in the Lost Woods I am. So in other words, I'm lost in the Lost Woods. Who would have guessed? Luckily, I do have a lot of fairies and bottles and stuff. Oh, you know what? I do know where I am in relation to... Yep, that's a pit. If I fall down here, I do know where I am in relation to the, the thing. So where are we, like, at the real world? Ow, that was rude. Um, Because I know that that's, like, the log that you can go into. One of these, at some point, is going to have a door behind it and I'm gonna be ready for it. Okay, well, that makes a noise as if I solved something, but I really haven't. There we go. So we're going back over here again. I still don't have much of an answer for this. If I was on the, if these statues were on the other side, I could hookshot them, but I can't do that here. Maybe I could hookshot these enemies. That'd be great. Come on over, come on. I mean, it gets rid of them, which is fantastic, but that's a whole different situation. Oh, you know what? Okay, and that loops me back around to that area. So now I know. I'm going to assume that, I mean, or guess at the least. I gotta be careful, because these guys are the worst. I don't know why they do two damage. Whoa, okay, there's another open mouth over this way. I don't know if it's worth going into those pits. There's pits that were to the south of the one open mouth. We'll just try this one. I mean, it is a different area. If it's a good area, that's anybody's guess. Oh, come on. <laughs> really? That stunk. Okay, revive me. Thanks. Okay, we're back up. Ready for round two? No, we're not. I thought the hook shots would at least hurt them a little bit. But I guess, you know, seeing how bows and arrows didn't, why would, why would that? Uh, there we go. Will that hurt these guys? It will, ooh. And that actually even made me go over to them. Which is weird why it's like that for some enemies but not others. Anyways, boom. Oh, that must have hurt. There's the button. I will press that button in just a moment once I'm absolutely sure, I don't know one of these are gonna hit me. 
What's going on with this? I will do that later. Are the enemies back? Thank goodness they're not. Oh no, it's one of these. But how can I do that? That doesn't make no sense. Can I like drag something with? Huh. Because I can push this on the button just fine. Can you stop that, sir? The problem is how do I follow, you know? That don't make no sense. Oh my gosh. I don't know, what's what's going on with that one? I might have to come at it from a different angle. These have been really challenging recently. Can I grab onto you? No, it just sort of knocks you back. Hmm. I don't have any keys for this room. So unless you're willing to give me one. Which you are not. Or the skull, aha, the skull had one for me. Yep, not happening. I'm pressing the wrong button. Can I push this, if I can push this thing into a pit, I can sneak over there again, just like I did in the other area. But I don't know if I can do that. Oh, not happening. Yeah, I can't just walk over though. Darn. I feel like I'm almost there with this one. But obviously that's not it. Like I can hook shot to these things, but the angling is not correct. There's a lot of issues going on here. This is a really tough one though, so far. Definitely the toughest yet. Ah, okay, that's creepy. I don't like that one bit. Maybe one of these is hiding like a secret or something. I think I'm right on top of, or at least yeah, very near where the actual marker is on the map. So this is where I'm a bit curious. If I use the mirror, where am I? Oh, <laughs> just, just in the forest bramble somewhere. All right, well, not too helpful. Yeah, I don't think this is something where I need to constantly travel between the two. That'd make it so complicated as if it's not complicated enough. Uh, whoop. Ah, what a jerk. I'm so sick of those guys. All right, that's my last fairy too. I have like a potion, but that only solves so many problems. Oh. Hmm. Oh, there's a heart. I need as many of those as I can get. What about, the, this was the one I was looking for before. I don't think I've been in this room. Not yet. Hey, don't take me out of it. I'm in the zone right now. Hmm. No, don't you dare, you stinker, come on. This is hard enough as it is. Okay, I'm back here. <laughs> it's, it's nothing to complain about. Don't you dare. I'm just gonna do that. And then run down this way. Also, slice all of these. If I can. No, you don't. So how do I get past this? Like that, so what was the point of the, oh wait, I have been here before, haven't I? What was the point of like most of that? I feel like there's like a lot of pointless rooms in this one so far. Not a big fan. I can go in here though. Uh, please don't just let this be one of this, one of these f famous pointless rooms. Did that bring me anywhere? Nowhere worth my while. Wait, usually leaving will undo that. Why didn't it undo it? Okay, I need the hook shot. Okay, well, that, I'm not complaining about that! You're kidding me. Um, stop. Oh my gosh! Come on. Get out of here. One of these has to have like a key or something. I spent a key to get in here. If one of these better have a key, none of them have a key. I don't understand this whole place. It's just topsy-turvy, it's all messed up. Why? What's the point of it even being there? What are you talking about? Who designed this? I need, I need to write a letter to them and ask them what they were thinking. Because this is just ridiculous. 
Stop doing that. Yeah, this is like totally nonsensical. Like I just don't even understand. I haven't begun to piece together what is actually happening here. Because there's so many rooms you go and you, you put a key in to get into these places and they're totally useless. They have no, no function. <laughs> I just don't understand. And there's a whole set of rooms somewhere I haven't even reached. I probably have equally as little effectiveness. So it says that there's a door up here. And to that I say I don't believe you. Unless this list leads somewhere. Cause the yellow is door, right? I'm pretty sure that the yellow means door. Unless you mean like the way I entered this room, which isn't really a door. As much as it's just me falling down. Okay, you know what? I really need the potion now because I have no other fairies. So select that, drink the potion. I really didn't want to have to do this, but I do have to do it. Come on, got him. Do that to you. No, you don't. Stop that. Oh yeah, and this is the one I can't solve because I, I, oh. Maybe I might know how to solve it. I think that the statue is a deterrent. Maybe. That's it. No, you don't press the button? You're telling me you're not useful whatsoever? Try that again. Oh, you are so useless. Come on, dude. You can't even press a button for me. Maybe I could fall into this room. I don't think so, because the statue's reset once you leave it. So I do not understand. There must be, that must be something I open up once I find out, once I find out how to get there. Like, you know, once I get one of the chests that gives me a new item that totally solves that issue. Like, that has to be the problem. But this one is like super unconventional in a way that's really hard to work with. I mean, at the least I can go back down here. I don't know if that's actually gonna be helpful. Let me take a look. Yeah, being here isn't really doing anything for me. But it does seem to count that as a door, which is ridiculous. It's also saying, ah, oh, there's a room here. But also that I've been there? I mean, I did find the map. But have I been in this room? I have not. I don't know why that room wasn't dark then. Because that room was not dark. The issue now, what do I do about this room? I, do, I don't know. I didn't really mean to leave. I was gonna try to like hug the wall a little bit. <laughs> I don't know if that's gonna work. I highly doubt it, but it sort of almost worked. Oh yeah, I can just sort of hug the wall. That's so weird. Uh, oh, I thought that was gonna make me fall. What's going on in here? I don't know. There we go. Got it. You get out of here. Ooh, the big chest, but I don't have the big key. Oh darn. I guess maybe I've technically been a part of this room is the thing. Yeah, okay. That's the issue. Hmm. But now I've made it into there, so that's at least one puzzle solved, I suppose. So the question for me now, hmm is how do I get to the set of rooms on the left of B1? That's the first question. The second question is, where is the big key? None of these questions I have answers to, by the way, but I'm hoping I can find them. So yeah, I haven't gone into these pits. I might as well try it. Whoa. I swear they didn't show up on the map before. Or maybe it did. Yeah, okay, I've been here. Never mind. Anticlimactic. Uh I don't know if there's much I can do. I just like I swear these rooms change every time I go in them. It's ridiculous. 
So it's saying that there's a room over this way, which I, I'm pretty sure I can concur is correct. I can't go into it from here. I was once able to go into it. I don't know what happened. But at the least, I can go back up this way. Ow, dude! Did you really have to hit me Ow, for two? Uh, usually I can get rid of this guy. Like that, but <laughs> okay, it doesn't matter much. I will go to the left one. I must have fallen into this one. Yeah, that was the first, this is the first one I fell into. Gotcha. It keeps making that noise as if I solved something. I feel like I did the opposite, I just made more questions. Stop it. Oh my gosh, what do you do? Like, this is just getting ridiculous. Oh, I'm a dingus. I didn't realize you could pull the thing. I thought you could only push it. I didn't realize you could like hold the A button and pull it. I don't think you could do that for any other thing. I swear it. Maybe I'm wrong. But I don't know, just like an oddly specific. Okay. Well, let's give it a tug, light up there, and then what, what do we got in this room? Okay, guys, calm down. That's not fair, I'm not even out of the entryway. Luckily, it didn't get me. I do see a bombable spot over here, too. Don't you dare, I'm busy. I'm really busy as it is, and I'd really like it if you didn't remove me from the situation. Don't. Thank you. Oh, gosh. Okay, pick up the skull. What in the world is that? That's a, I'm a bunny now. I'm the bunny, I didn't wanna be the bunny. How do I, okay, I, 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 my, I'm not a bunny anymore. Oh, we got the big key. Yeah, I'm gone. See ya, we are out of here. <laughs> That's not what I meant. Okay, go, 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 go. So we have the big key. At the least, I know for a fact that can get me the big chest. I don't think it gave me anything else right now. So, oh my gosh. This is insane. And if I die, I don't know where I'm gonna show up. So don't let these annoying things hit me because they will do two hearts of damage and everything I worked for will be gone, maybe, potentially. It is what I dread. So I guess I'll pop back down here. And I will take a look. Okay. So I can, first off, hopefully get some extra health from all this. Don't get hit by that. Some of it was at least willing to give me extra health, which is fantastic. Okay, do I really need this last one? I don't. So, I can just hug this wall. I can check all these for some extra little bit of health. Nothing. But I am slowly, uh earning my health back. Come on, stop, that's so silly, come on. Don't you think I need the health? Okay, whoa, what is this? You found the fire rod. This rod commands the red fire, but watch your magic meter. Well, that's cool and everything, but how do I use that to complete this dungeon? Because honestly, I'm clueless. I really have no clue what we do next. So what I think I have to do is I have to go back to that weird skeletal structure we saw before. I was looking around on how to get there, and I realized I have to go through the temple again. So here we are. I think I gotta leave right about here. Ugh. I did not like that thing. Um, Cause I've, I've still not gone up that way. In that one part of the dungeon. But you know what, I might not need to. For right now, I definitely don't. Get rid of these things. I just, I do not like them. They're my least favorite enemy so far. So what's going on with this? Can I hit this with the fire rod? Let's hope. Whoa, that worked! Whoa, it's eyes open, that's creepy. So what's going on inside of here? I don't know. Um, I don't have any keys. But, is there something blocking my way? I can't see if there is or not. So that's weird. Uh, that's not fair, that's not fair. Uh, hit you with the fire rod, please and thank you. So I guess I have to go over that at some other point. Whoa. Can I push this? No. I don't have a key for this. So what do I do? There's nothing I can accomplish here. Not unless I find a way either 
down here again. I don't understand. Oh! Oh, okay. I didn't realize I could go up here. I was a little bit, I don't know, just like weird. Okay, that's a wall. I can't go that way. Oh, that hit me. Oh, great. <laughs> Luckily, I did find a fairy along the way. Right? Yeah, okay. My gosh, this dungeon has been one of those, one of those dungeons that you just never want to think about ever again. I mean, it has to be up this way, right? Can I just like hide in this corner? Thank you. And then, where am I? I'm right here. Can I, okay. I just, I'm trying to figure this all out. It's so stressful. Oh, can I get you a little bit, sir? Ow, no, stop. Okay, the, I always forget this doesn't work on you. I gotta use my magic more. I get a lot of it, and I just don't use it. And it really helps me. So I don't know if I actually need to, oh gosh, this thing's gonna attack me. It turns me into a bunny. I don't like it. Luckily, it's only for a few moments. Where, I can't see the dude. I don't know, I feel like there's a lot of baloney happening in this one too. Just like stuff that's not really actually my fault. Anyways, there's that done. The problem is I gotta make my way back up. Uh, okay, I made it. I don't think there was any bombable spots in there. So now I just have to run through all of this baloney without this guy getting me. Okay, but I have a key. I can't see where I am. I'm over here. Uh. And with this key, if the game is kind to me, I can run over here no, and go into here. What is this about? I don't know, but I will try my best. Ah, stop it. Stop doing that all of the time. Oh, that was a two for one. Thank you for the extra. Ah! I got it, and then I lose it again, and then I get it again, and I lose it again. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I don't know if there's too much more except for these things, which I really need, so don't get me wrong. Uh, There we go. Ooh. Can I get one more heart? I cannot. There we go. I made it. Heading out of there. Hitting you with the fire rod. And you. And then switch over to the lantern. Very good. Back to the fire rod. I wish I could like how to equip two separate things here, but I, I suppose I cannot. Will this light them up? It does, that's great. Oh, I could have gone for a two for one deal. Just like that. Okay, and then light that one up. Did that not do what I thought it was going to do? Or did I miss one? Or did, yeah, this one finally went out. Ah, I see. There we go. <laughs> we did it. No, we didn't do it. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna go and then go back and just try to do this as quickly as I can. I guess leaving and coming back didn't change much. Ah, oh, but the, the moment I do one, it undoes the other. Stop doing that. Okay, I'm just gonna give it a second. Give it a second for all of them to go out because that's messing me up. Because if I fire one that's already lit, it doesn't re light it, it still has to go through its course, which is really dumb. There we go. Run, 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 run. Hit that one, and then quickly, yeah, we made it. I don't know what you would have to do there if you ran out of stuff. I guess just, I don't know, give up and try again. <laughs> okay, no, no. Hop, I'm about, I can't do it anymore. Oh no. Get out of here, be gone, thank you. Oh. Uh, really? Was that necessary? Tell me honestly, was that necessary? <laughs> do I have to do it all over again? Because it looks like I have to do it all over again. No wait, I wanted that health. Okay, it's just sort of sitting there, so I can still grab it. Uh, don't fall. Extra health, thank you. Extra mana. Awesome. Yeah, that hand's gonna fall for me. And is everybody back here? Of course they are. Is the door open? 
The door's not open. Even if I've already accomplished this, you think the game would just help me out a little bit? No. For no reason, it has to be problematic. Stop, please. Jeez, this dungeon is just, I feel like it's as difficult in ways that it doesn't need to be, which is the opposite of fun. Stop that. And I know that, yeah, arrows don't work on this guy, which is also not necessary. You know what? I'm gonna hit him, grab this for, yeah, a full refill. Oh, and if I use the magic while it's refilling, it sort of still works just fine. Go for that, and then go, 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 go. So for real this time, get rid of this guy. Whoop. Stop that. Like, is that necessary? <laughs> like, why is this constantly have to do this to me? And it makes a noise as if, like, that accomplished something. The hand coming down and missing me. One of these has to be a door. Aha! I have finally found you. The one door that's actually real. Go in. Oh gosh, um, I don't know how to get rid of those those guys. I think I just have to hit them with the pot. There we go, and we get a key, which we can use to go through here, but I also have to test all these. This, like, this whole dungeon's been making me go crazy. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on with this stuff. Don't you dare. Ow. I don't need it. I mean, I sort of kind of needed it. Whoa! Whoa! Hold on, he can't just throw a boss fight at me like that. I had no warning. How much mana do I have? Maybe I have enough to do this? Was that worth it? Probably not. I don't even know what I'm doing with this boss fight. I have three hits. Oh, I knocked you into the spikes. That was a mistake, wasn't it? Um, oh my gosh. You know what? If I don't have any mana, I might as well. It seems like the magical stuff usually doesn't work. Ow, anyways. Oh, you take, you do two damage. Why do you do two damage? Is that necessary? Oh, man. At least I'm not too far back, but I don't, I don't know how easy this is truly going to be. I mean, the opposite of easy, most likely. I, I probably should have tried using bows and arrows against him. Okay, so I'm immediately gonna try to, yeah, switch over to the bows and arrows and see if this actually does anything. It looks like it does not. Oh my gosh, this boss is ridiculous. Ah, oh, man, oh man, it's just like the most disorienting thing as a reward for getting through the most disorienting dungeon of all time. This is, this is too much. This is way too much. Ah, come on, why are you in the corner? Oh, oh, really, really, it only takes that many hits, okay. Oh my gosh, that was crazy. Like, that would have been a tough boss as it was without the moving floor, but okay, I'll take it, we won. I really hope that was the hardest dungeon in the game. <laughs> because if they're any harder than this, I, I don't know. I don't know how to handle that. That was crazy. Oh man, but we did save our third lady, whatever they're called, the descendants, the maidens. Link, because of you, I can escape from the clutches of, of the evil monsters, thank you. Do you know the pro prophecy of the great cataclysm? This is the way I heard it. If a person who has an evil heart gets the Triforce, a hero is destined to appear. And he alone must face the person who began the Great Cataclysm. If the evil one destroys the hero, nothing can save the world from his wicked reign. Only a person of the Knights of Hyrule who protected the royalty of Hylia can become the hero. You are of their bloodline, aren't you? Then you must rescue Zelda without fail. Well, that, that's definitely not any more pressure than I already have. May the way of the hero lead to the Triforce. All right, well, luckily now, finally get a health refill. That was nightmarish how difficult all that was, but luckily we got it done, which means in the next episode, we'll be marching on over to the next area, which will be back at the town, actually. So we'll figure that out. Hopefully things will go well. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. Before you go, be sure to comment Lost to Zebra, so now you've watched at the end of the You're a Zebra-tastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.